Hey streamers! In this video, I'll be talking about the general options under WP Stream Settings, and this is the first part of a four-part series where I'll be discussing each and every one of the settings that you'll see in a second. So first, go to WP Stream Settings, and here are all the different settings. Like I said, today I'll be discussing the general options and the rest later. The first part is changing the slug, which is by default currently WP Stream. So you want to change this. Um, if you want to change this, you have to do it over here. So as you can see, here is the default and we want to change this part. So I'll change it to my stream and save changes. If I go back and refresh, you'll see that it is changed from WP Stream to my stream. The next part is who is allowed to live stream on your website. So you can choose which user role has permission to um, live stream on your website. So let's go to a specific user and change their role from a subscriber to a contributor, for example. Make sure you update the user to save it. This is very important. And go back to settings and you'll also change the role over here. You have to change it both for the user and here as well. Then save changes. And then the next part is about what type of channel the user can use to live stream. So either a free to view live channel or a pay per view live channel. For a pay per view live channel, you can also set up the default pay per view price. And this is in dollars always. So $5, $10, whatever. And once you set that up, you can save your changes and that is it. So that is it for the general options under WP Stream settings and the next videos will be discussing the default settings.